All right. I want to say all praises be to Abba Noah, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Harakakudash, Double honest to the apostles was a quantum of great millstone and rule well. I shall warm to the sincere brethren I came out there across the four winds, the four corners of the globe, pushing this truth, this good news of good news of Yahweh Shai, proclaiming salvation to the elect of Israel, so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, and proclaiming the downfall of Esau Edom, the so-called white man, and his evilous empire. You understand? So basically, one of the big news of the day. Is what the royal so-called royal family over there in the UK, United Kingdom, Britain, is a racist man. That that's supposed to be the big news of the day, man, of the week. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You have this uh this uh this American lady, man, mixed race. She could be a Jake, she could be a Tay, who married into the royal so-called royal family over there in Britain, man. And hey, they were telling her, man, hey, they're not gonna give her son protection. Because he have that what Negro blood in him, man. He 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 might be too dark skin, man. He's too dark skin. You understand? But guess what? That that so called royal family over there in Britain, man. Those are usurpers. Those are impostors, man. Those ain't the original royal family of of the UK. The original royal family is men like King James, man. You know what I mean? Who who are authorized the translation of the scriptures, man? So called black men, man. Of which this new new so-called royal family they usurp that man they the Edomites man they usurp the throne man you know what I mean backed by what the elites the Rothschilds the Rockefellers man you understand but guess what where where they going where the Queen of England the the Prince of England all of them man going they going into captivity man you know you understand because they have that Edomite line man you know what I mean and the scriptures tell you that man that them king the kings and queens of these heathen nations man. Hey, they're going to bow, man. They're going to come in shackles and chains. You understand? This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 60, verse 10. And the sons of strangers shall build up thy walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee. For in my wrath I smote thee, but in my favor have I, sh have I ha ha but in my favor have I had mercy on thee. Can't see what they said. Strangers, the sons of strangers, man. Who is these sons of stra strangers? Heathens. So, so these heathens, man, they're, go, they're gonna build, build up, build up Jerusalem. They're gonna build up Israel. They're gonna build up the world, man. And I said, our world, man. You know what I mean? So all the king of England, queen of England, you know what I mean? The, the, the king of Babylon, man. Joe Biden, different presidents. You know what I mean? The different presidents and heads of states of Russia, Iran, China, North Korea. All these strangers, man. All these heathens. They, they're gonna what? The kings shall minister unto us, men, serve us. For in my wrath I smote thee, but in my favor have I, have I had mercy on thee. Come, so that, that's the mercy of the Lord, man. He's going to put us over these heathens. You understand? Because right now we're in our lowest state. And these, these people being called royal, kings, queens, presidents, prime ministers, hey, they're going down though. Because they're heathens, man. They're not of the royal regal lineage of King David, man. You know what I mean? Of, of the sons of Israel, of, of the sons of Benjamin, of the sons of Levi, of the sons of Issachar, of the sons of Ephraim, of the sons of uh, the sons of Asher. You know and I mean the twelve tribes, the twelve patriarchs, they, they're not of that royal regal, regal lineage, man. They they impostors, they heathens, man. They're nobodies, man. You understand? Yeah, let me get that, man. They're nobodies, man. You know what I mean? And are you Jake's bugged out about oh the royal family races? No door, no shit, man. The, the Brit, you know what the British Empire, man, did to the so-called uh, West Indians, man? You, you Jamaicans, you Guyanese, you know what I mean? You Trinidadians, you Barbadians, you know what I mean? You Antiguans, you people from St. Lucia, you people from Dominica, you people from Grenada, you people from St. Vincent, all these different islands and countries, man, you know what I mean? Of the West Indies. You know what? You know what the British devils did to, did to you, man. They had you in hundreds of years of slavery, man. You know what I mean? The British sl slave trade, man. You understand? That's what they did to the tribe of Benjamin predominantly, man. Had you in hardcore slavery, man. Kicking your ass, man. You understand? But you, but you still bugged out about about uh, the royal family being racist. You all surprised and bent out of shape and feeling a type of way. You you niggas are simple, man. You niggas are bugged out, man. You niggas are. 
You, you niggas are dumb, man. You niggas are sad. You understand? <laughs> this is the book of Second Ezra, chapter six, verse fifty-four. And after these, and after these, Adam also, whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures, of him come we all, and the people also whom whom, whom thou hast chosen. Can't say we all come out of that 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 uh, that lineage, that royal lineage of Adam, man. You understand? And the royal lineage stem through what? Israel. All this I have spoken before thee, O Lord, because thou hast made us, thou made us the world for our sakes. And our is what? A possessive pronoun, man. Who is the our? Israel. Because Ezra is an Israelite himself. You understand? As for the other people, the heathens, which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing. Can't so these kings and queens, or, or the kings and queens of England, the kings and queens of Spain, Denmark, France, the presidents, the prime ministers of all these different countries, man, heathen, heathen countries, hey, they are as nothing, man. As for the other people which also come of Adam, thou hast said they are nothing, but be like unto spittle. Can you know what spittle? Spittle is a rejection of the body, man. That, that's something you want to cast out the body. Spit, man. You know what I mean? Somebody spit on you, that's like the ultimate disrespect. So that's how, that's how you how I should view these other nations like spittle, man. Insignificant. And has likened the abundance of, of them unto a drop that fall it from a vessel. Can't so like you have a bucket of water and then a drop fall from it. You don't even you don't even know a drop fall from it, man. That 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 that, that is not it's not even present in your mind that a drop of water fell from your bucket, your full bucket of water, man. That's these heathens, man. They don't even come to mind to to your how about shame your shy. They didn't they're not on his list of pri priorities, man. You understand? <clears throat> And now, O Lord, behold, these heathens, which have ever been reputed as nothing, have become to be lords over us and to devour us. Can't that's what you see, man? You have these devils calling themselves the royal family, man. Enslaving us, oppressing us, man. Talking shit to us, man. You understand? You have these devils in America, these devils in France, Spain. You know what I mean? These different heathens, these Chinese, Japanese, man. East Indians, Arabs, Africans, man, ruling over us, man. And they are nothing, man. But they're ruling over us, man. They usurped us. You understand? It's just a disgrace, man. You understand? And you jakes, you, you, you simple-minded jakes, still in that comatose state, man. You know what I mean? When you gonna rise up, man? When Judah, when you Judah is gonna rise up, man? You understand? When you Ephraimite's gonna rise up, man? You understand? When you when you black, when you so-called African Americans gonna rise up, when you so-called Puerto Ricans gonna rise up, man? You understand? Hey, but it's all of the Lord, man. And that's, that's, why we, that's why we understand that, man. 12,000 man out of each tribe, man. The elect. But we, thy people, whom thou hast called thy firstborn, children of Israel, thy only begotten and thy fervent lover, are given unto their, into their hands. Can we under the power? We under the power of these heathens, man. Under their subjection. You understand? If the world now be made for our sakes, why do we not possess an inheritance with the world? How long shall this endure? Can't say Ezra was complaining thousands of years ago, man. <laughs> thousands of years ago, Ezra was complaining about these heathens ruling over us, man. To the most time, man. But guess what? Hey, you still complaining to this day, man. And guess what? The most say, hey, speeding things up, man. The dominoes are rolling, man. The dominoes are falling. You understand? And deliverance is nigh, man. These heathens gonna soon be on our, our, our full subjection. You understand? And that's why we can't wait, man. We can't wait, man. We cannot wait. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 2, verse 1. Why do the heathen range and the people imagine a vain thing? The kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Come, hey, so why do the heathen rage, man, and the people imagine a vain thing? Can't say, hey, you, you heathens in rulership, man, especially you, you Edomites, and you, what you imagine a vain thing. What's that vain thing? That vain thing is that you're going to rule forever, man. You think that your house, like the book of Psalms, in this book of Psalms, they say, you think that your house uh, is going to continue on forever. Briefly paraphrasing, man. You think you're going to be in rulership forever. La ah, man. That's a vain thing, man. And you what? Take counsel, man. The kings of the earth, man. The royal family, man. These different kings and presidents of these heathen nations. They take counsel 
against who the children of Israel they are, they are anointed, the chosen, you know what I mean? So called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. Seeking, seeking to what? Keep you down, man. Keep you, keep you oppressed. Keep you on the bottom. You understand? Keep you from rising up, man. Keep you from what? Uh, fulfilling, fulfilling what? Your, your true, your true uh, potential, man. As the rulers of the planet, man. You understand? Let me jump down to verse 8. Acts of me, and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance. Because these heathens are our inheritance, man. And inheritance is what? Something you owe, man. So these heathens belong unto us, man. They, they're the servants of the children of Israel, of the sons of God, man. You understand? That's, what these, that's who these heathens are, man. They, they're the servants of the sons of God, man. You understand? And the uttermost parts for thy, and the uttermost, uttermost parts of the earth, earth for thy possession. Come, so the whole earth belongs to the children of Israel, man. The islands in the Pacific, you know what I mean? All the way down to the whole, the, the whole seven continents, man. Every, every land, every sea, every island, you know what I mean? Every river, every ocean, every, every lake are, is the inheritance of the children of Israel. You understand? Including you heathens, man. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Right, so we're going to break you heathens up, man. We're going to break you up, man. The royal family, man. The kings and the presidents and the rulers of these heathens. The Moabites, the Ammonites. You know what I mean? The Japhites. The Cushites. You know what I mean? The Ishmaelites. The Elamites. The Edomites, for sure. The chief house of Amalek, for sure, man. We're going to break you to pieces, man. You know what I mean? We're going to put you in hardcore subjection, man. You understand? Hardcore subjections and shackles and chains, man. So what awaits the royal family, man? The so-called royal family of the UK, man? A shackles and chains, man. Because they're impostors, man. They're not the real deal, man. They're, they're a bunch of white supremacists, racists, you know what I mean? Demons, man. You understand? So with that, I want to say... All praises be to Abanawa Yahweh Bahashim Yahushai Bahashim Harukakudash. The balance to the apostles was a quantum of great millstone to rule well. And shalom to the sensei brethren Akim out there. Class of four wins the four corners of the globe. Shalom.